Hey everybody, so I am an American teacher. My name is Dan and I'm from America and I've been teaching in China for two years and I love it here and you're going to see all about my experiences. This is uh, southern China, this uh, southern east, southeastern China. It's called Fuzhou and it's very hot during this time of year. This is my building. You can see we'll take you inside the building after. But right now, we're going to show you around the campus to start, and then we're going to take you around the city a little bit, and hopefully we can get some people to talk to, answer some questions, and you're going to get a good idea of what it's like being in China. Okay, so we're on our way now to a friend of mine's dorm. I want to show you a dorm, an average dorm of a student here who goes here. So, so Bob, let's go. So, okay, so this is my friend Will. You're going to see him after. <laughs> he came to visit me. He's amazing with photography. He was my best student. I've taught at two different universities, and he was my best student at the university I taught at last year. And he came to help me with the video. Well, more than help me actually do the video. And he's going to explain some of the Chinese customs that we see, because people here do things quite differently. See that? I didn't even get through the door. <laughs> so people do things quite differently here than they do in the United States. So you can take a look around. This is leaving my building. You're going to see a lot of girls will be carrying umbrellas. Uh, not these over here because the sun is going down. But why do girls carry umbrellas? Well, because uh, they are afraid of getting tan. They're afraid of getting tan. Now in the United States, girls like a little color. They like a little tan because it gives makes them look healthy. Yeah. Why do Chinese girls find that they think they're healthier without a tan? Ni hao, girls. Ni hao. Ni hao, ni hao. Hi, say hi. Hi, hi it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> That's funny. You are funny, girls, you are funny. Thank you. <laughs> so they don't like, they're not carrying umbrellas. I don't think they care. And yeah. guys, guys, you never see carrying umbrellas. So, all right, as a man, are you attra more attracted to a girl who's white? Mm, really? Of course. Uh, of course, than a girl with a tan. Mm, yeah, personally, I prefer a girl who is white, not a tan. Okay, and I think most Chinese guys feel that way too. Yeah, because I've talked a lot of to a lot of Chinese guys. And what about guys? Can guys? I don't see guys with umbrellas at mm. all. So is it not as important for a guy to be white as it is for a girl to be white? Mm, as long as you're handsome, it doesn't matter if you're tan or white. <laughs> What do you? Th what are the three things a girl looks for in a guy? She looks for uh, height. Someone who's very tall, right? Who's very tall. They go, oh, oh, he's so tall. Oh, I could have, I could have tall babies with him, right? Isn't that? Yeah. That's what they think. Yeah. Ni hao, ni hao, ni hao. And so, and what else? Hmm. You have a lot of money. Money. Yeah. money. So money is a universal thing. Because no matter where you go, everyone wants a person with money, right? Yeah. All right. And let's see. Money and height and good looks. Yeah, good looks. Good looks. Good looks. Okay. So we're okay. We're all okay in that area. Yeah. Well, both of us. Okay. So we should... You're handsome, we, huh? Uh, I, I don't know. You know, I don't think so. But a lot of girls say you're handsome. Ni hao, ni hao. Don't worry, we'll get a girl to talk. Would you like to talk? You could tell me more, anything you like. <laughs> Nothing? Nothing? This is an outdoor restaurant. So we have many cafeterias we're going to show you after. This is an outdoor one. And you can see that a lot of the guys um, will, and girls will eat outside on nice days here. It's really nice atmosphere. And you could just chill out and relax. Here is a very tall man. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> I bet he's on the basketball team. <laughs> and he doesn't play guard either. Yeah. 
So we're continuing. This is the uh, path from my apartment. And soon we're going to pass all the cafeterias. Most of the cafeterias are in one row. We call this cafeteria row. No, I'm kidding. Uh, it's like Taiwan shop. If any of you speak Chinese, then. How was my Chinese on that row? Well, right? Very good. Oh, okay. it's just, it's just, it's just. So this is where all the cafeterias are, and they're on the way to Frank's apartment. Frank is a senior student, and he's an English student, so his English is pretty good. And uh, let's actually take a look at him from this angle. And in, in this cafeteria, you're going to see when we go in, there are many cafeterias in the cafeteria. So it's very cool. And I'm going to show you all the kinds of food that are in there because that's the first thing people ask me when they know I'm from America. Food is very, very, very important to the Chinese people, isn't it, Will? Yeah. So they always say to me, do you like Chinese food? That's the first question, Chinese people. Of course I like Chinese food. I mean, what's not to like about Chinese food, right? Yeah. You have chopsticks, you use them, and you eat Chinese food. And, you know, if you, if you don't like rice or noodles, you're probably in trouble. But if you don't like rice and noodles, uh, I don't know what you would like. Hi. 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 You want to say hi? Come on. Say hi. Come on. Say hi. She's... Hello. 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 Oh, she's so shy and cute. A little Hello. shy. A little shy. Idian. Idian. Say ma. Have you seen many Americans? They walk. Oh, they walk. Ah, ah, good, 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 good. Welcome to our Ah, thank you so much. Thank you so much. It was nice seeing you. Bye-bye. 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 Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, so... This is very shy. Yeah. You get a lot of shy people here. But this guy is will not be shy. I promise you. I have no idea who he is. Come on over. Say hello. Say hello. Say hello. Hello. Oh. Come on over. I, I, no, come on. <laughs> uh, he's shy too. Okay, so these are all cafeterias also. And as I said, there are cafeterias, inside cafeterias. Upstairs, there are cafeterias. Upstairs here, there are cafeterias and a dance studio. If we're lucky later, we'll see some people dancing. Maybe we can sneak in. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go back to Frank or he's going to be pissed off in a Chinese kind of way, which means you don't know whether he's really pissed off. You can see it's a beautiful day. What are these? Are these storms? Storms, I think. Storms. You can see. So after the cafeteria, we have some dorms. And Frank's building is right over there. We're going to see it, and we're going to go in and see what an apartment looks like. This college has only four people to an apartment. But where I was... Will's school has six people to an apartment, yeah. is that right? Yeah, right. So very, very crowded. Uh, his apart. I think your rooms have a, sh have a shower in each room. Have, have a shower. These don't. These have a shower for one floor, and you see a million people uh, in the shower. We won't film them naked, but that's the way it is. Okay. Ni hao, ni hao. Anyone want to say a few words? Ni hao. Here. Okay, Frank building. Here we go. Let me text him on my uh, yeah, my Frank, by the way, plays for the soccer team in college, so we can give you an idea as to some sports and how they're done. And Frank's actually working. Frank is one of the guys, he didn't want to go to graduate school. He wanted to work after college and he wants to work in marketing. And so he got a job with the school, which he will tell you about. Let's go. Go back. Ni hao. Ni hao. Could you come here? 
Dragon Boat Festival weekend. Yeah. Is that right? Right. And so a lot of people have gone home for it. And what is Dragon Boat Festival, Will? Mm, means Dragon Boat Festival. Yeah, it really is <laughs> complicated to explain it in English. But there's uh, one very famous poet called Chu Yuan. Okay. And he did a suicide. Then, oh. Then we. And celebrate this festival because no one hate, no one liked him, and they were happy he killed himself. <laughs> <laughs> why? 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 <laughs> uh, we all love him, and uh -huh. then really a little complicated. Experience. Okay. Yeah. So this guy killed himself, and was it because they were being attacked by somebody? Was China being attacked by somebody? And no, it's in ancient China. Okay. It's in ancient China. And did he have to commit suicide because he had no other chance to survive? So he didn't. I hear they jumped off a boat. These people jumped off a boat or something. Um, it's hard to explain. How to explain? Okay, right. we'll look it up later and give a better explanation. Yeah. Come on, say hello. Hi. Hi. What's your name? I'm Dan. My name is Dan. Hey, he said his name. Oh, come here, come here. Oh, good. What's, what's your my, name? My mother. This is your mother? Uh, Mama. Uh, Mama. Oh, that's so sweet. Uh, and you go here to Zhichang. But oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh. What do you study? Uh, do you study engineering? One, one, one. What? What? What does he study? Well, uh, you are what major? Design. Oh, automatic engineering. Oh, engineering. Ah, very good, very good. And what do you? What grade are you in? You in your second year here? Second. Or third year? Second. Third year. Oh. And do you live in Suzhou? You live in Suzhou? You now live in Suzhou? Or are you in school? Or are you in school? Or are you in school? He's in school. He's in school. Oh, of course. But your hometown. Where? In Nandi. Where are you from? Where are you from? Oh, Chenzhou. Oh, very nice. Very nice. That's so nice. And you came by to just visit him? Did you bring him some zongzi? 呃，就是他说，是今天是端午节，所以来看他的吗？对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。对。我之前没有见过你，或者说我们以后可以成可以成为朋友，然后可以经常一起出去玩。好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好Based on or E, because I look good like my back. Ah, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you too. Okay. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Yeah. Good. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you. Okay. Nice day. Okay. Bye bye. 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 Bye b
because Chinese people hate when you're late, and we're probably a little late, so Frank was worried. Uh, you are, you know, fashionable late. <laughs> Fashionably late. <laughs> they, these guys learn, you got to give them credit. They, they learn a lot of stuff. So I was explaining that some people go to graduate school after, and you're not going to graduate school because you yeah. chose to work. And he's working for a great company called New Oriental. Oh, boy. And uh, so far he likes it, right? Mm, yeah, yeah. So far he likes it. And today he's a day off because it's Dragon Boat Festival. Oh, Will had a little bit of history lapse with Dragon Boat Festival. Maybe you could t tell us something about it. Something more about yeah. Dragon Boat Festival. Why did, who committed suicide and why? Oh, uh, I tell you? Yeah, tell us. Oh, yeah, uh, there's a, there's a government officer named Xu Yuan. Ah. He was a very, uh, very uh, loyalty, loyalty and very honor officer. But the king doesn't uh, believe him. Uh, so he suicided himself to show her, to show his loyalty to the country. Uh -huh. And after that, uh, his country was attacked by another country. Ah, very, very good. That's a reason. And so why, um, so we celebrate that holiday in honor of him? Uh, yeah. Just that one person? Yeah. Okay. And is there any reason Zong is eaten during this time? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, he uh, jumped into a river and the people throw zongzi into the river. Yeah, really? the, yeah. Uh, because this way, they think uh, the fish will eat zongzi instead of him. Oh, very cool. Instead I of like his that. body. I yeah. like that, I like that. All right, cool. Nice. Now we know Dragon Boat Festival. <laughs> and about half the school or more leaves home for Dragon Boat Festival. Right? Yeah. Because a lot of a lot of students in Chinese in China like to go home for festivals. It's not like America, where people want to drink and party and do all these kinds of things and say, "Oh, I'm away from my parents. This is great." In China, they're a little closer, and so they tend to go home more often, especially if you live around the area. So that's why the campus you'll see isn't very crowded as it was. Uh, as it might be on during a regular weekday or regular school day. Okay, cool. So let's take a quick look at Frank's apartment. And as I said, there are four people in an apartment here. It's probably messy because if it weren't, it wouldn't be Zhicheng College or any other college in China. And here we go now. Zobab. So yeah. Zobab, so by the way, means let's go. <laughs> and you also see Shabis like this or uh, people who are driving motorbikes. It's the all outside when we go outside later and they could kill you. Mm -hmm. It's more dangerous than New York City, I'm telling you, with the cars and stuff. See, all these people have motorbikes. These bikes have become... These bikes have become a lot more popular in recent months. This is either an Ofo or a... What's the other kind, Frank? Mobile or mobile uh, bike, and you can pay one yuan, which is the equivalent of maybe 15 cents, mm -hmm. and you could drive it for an hour. Yeah, half an hour. Half an hour. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then you lock it. You lock it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then you could just leave it wherever you uh, want. So I could drive, get some coffee, leave my bike there. Maybe it'll be there when I come out. Maybe another person has taken it and rented it. And then I could either walk or find another bike. But it's pretty easy to find bikes. So those are the main ways of transportation around the campus. And of course, walking. Mm -hmm. People in Meguo need to do. You need to get out there, walk, and exercise. Do you mean by ma? Okay. We'll talk about that. Oh, let's talk about the building a little bit. Yep. So this is Frank's building, and um, every building here on campus, when you go in, you have to check in at night to show that you are in, because you have to be in by 10, 20? Uh, 10, 30. 
You have to be in by 10.30 at night. You wouldn't think so as the college. People are all out partying, but you have to be in at 10.30. So you have to press your fingerprint down to show that you're in at 10.30. Then I think that you get to stay out another half hour if you want. Is that right? To 11? Yeah. On weekends, maybe. Yeah, on weekends. And after that, the door will close, and I must climb the wall. And then he, clim <laughs> he climbs the wall like Superman like to get in. <laughs> Just so he can be uh, like a normal college, uh, normal grammar school kid in the United States who can come home at 11 o'clock. So it's kind of, a, you know, they're very strict on when you come in here. But a lot of kids have ways to get around that, so it's not too bad. And then, when we walk in to Frank's apartment, which I'll show you, Okay. A lot of people order takeout food because they're so lazy. You know, the Chinese people are great. Like, they exercise a lot, but when it comes to eating, they're very lazy. So they order takeout, and the takeout comes. The takeout man will just open the door and leave people's food. Yeah, that is a takeout man. This is a takeout man. Yeah. 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 You got the takeout man. How are you? <laughs> You have takeout food. Oh, Lee Sala. What? You have takeout food. Ah, takeout? <laughs> ah, yes. Say hi to Megua. Okay. <laughs> ah, sit, 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 sit. Thank you. Okay, so that's an example. You know, all day people are eating around this place. If it's not Zongzi, it's Food European. Okay. So this is Frank's building. As you can see, it's uh, not a bad building at all. But as we go up the floors, you'll see that the dorms aren't very new and they aren't uh, exactly spotless that we like in America. But that's China living for you, so you get used to it. How do you feel about your dorm? Mm, just so good. Just so so. So so, by the way, means he doesn't really like it that much. You know, so so means ah, but okay means good in China. If you ask a person, how did you do on your exam? And they say, uh, okay, that means they got like a hundred, like an A plus. But if they say so so, means that. So, he said his room is so so, the dorm is so so. Another distinction between us, right? Because to us, so so means the same thing as okay. So so, okay? Not to the Chinese. Okay. The, as you can tell, as we get further into the building, it becomes a little dirtier and dirtier and dirtier. And here comes the nice the lady. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of times I just pretend I know what they're saying. <laughs> Sometimes I'll say, dui, 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 dui. that means right, 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 right. She is a manager and cleaner in oh. our building, and she and her husband clean our building every day. They get up very early, maybe at about uh, 6 o'clock, and clean the toilet. Really? Yeah. Oh. And do they they live in the building? Oh uh, yeah. They live in the first floor. Uh, oh. Now is that like some of the classrooms in like the Tunan building where I teach? Oh yeah, yeah. They live in there, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's strange. A lot of the people, the workers, will actually live in the building that they work at. I guess it saves space, and they don't have to give them an apartment that way. So anything to save a, a few bucks. And you'll see women here working like crazy. 50, 60 year old women on the street, shoveling leaves and stuff. You won't see that too much in America either. So, but you'll see as we walk up that, um, you know, it's, it's not a luxury palace. I don't think uh, Chairman Xi would be living in here, but we'll take our, Take our kids from students.
Frank lives on the second floor. Frank's the soccer player for the team. And this is the way he keeps his, his exercise. What are all these bikes? So if you have a bike, you can just park it here on the second floor. Yeah, say you're afraid their back it will be stolen. I see. And now with the mofo bike and all the, or the ofo, yeah. the people have less bikes or they don't need them anymore. Yeah, they don't need it anymore. Ah, uh, yeah. I see. Since that's very good, they have been ready for a long time. Ah, ah, ah. I see. For me, bike, that means I understand. Hello! Oh, hello. How are you? Max. Ah, good, good. Okay, we're going down to Frank's dorm. And this is his small way. Here comes a very interesting fellow. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and this is Frank's room. Usually there'll be people in here playing computer games. Ah, we have light? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Give me a hug. Ah. This is one of Frank's roommates. What's your name? Um, my name is Zhuang Yun. Yes. Yeah. And what's your specialty? Computer games? No, no, no. What does he do? Mostly. Uh, reading. Reading? Reading. Reading? Uh, now, you, uh, what major are you? What, what do you study? Engineering. Engineering? Yeah. Where are you from? Which part of China? From Which? Zhejiang. Zhejiang. Uh, That's where Jiao is from, right? That's yeah. another, where, another area where, and in Zhejiang province, there's, uh, the cities of Ningbo and Hangzhou. Is that right? Yeah. Huh. Yeah. And uh, it's a great place. That's where the G23 was held with all the presidents of the world and stuff. They went to Hangzhou, so it's really pretty. So you must like it there. Yeah. Do you wish you were home now? No, no he will stay in Fuzhou. Stay in Fuzhou. And find a job now. Oh, yeah. during this period? Uh, well, you're looking for a job. Yes. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, very good. And do you have a girlfriend? No, 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 no. If you don't have a girlfriend in China, you're called a single dog. Single dog. <laughs> it, it's it kind of, I don't know why, because I call myself a single dog, but it's kind of... Lonely like a dog. Yeah, <laughs> lonely like a dog. People don't like to be called single dogs for some reason. I don't know why. I don't mind. But uh, it's that. So you'll see that there's four rooms. There's a... Uh, room for four people here and they sleep up there and they have their study desk below and it's always very crowded of course and they don't have washing machines in their room or anything so what do you guys do some of you use washing machines though right uh, yeah in the toilet in the toilet they wash their clothes in the toilet Oh no, they wash, their, <laughs> they wash their clothes in the washing machine, in the toilet. And then, but nobody has a dryer. Nobody in China uh, around here has a, you just hang your clothes up to dry. So they hang it up either inside or maybe, do you have a balcony, no? You can't hang it up outside? You can hang it up outside. And also, what's this? Flat, is this a... A uh, shade. A shade? Yeah. Oh. So when they want it, they take naps. Everyone in China take naps. Takes a nap between, or southern China, maybe between 12 and 1.30. And so they take, ah, uh, so they take naps. So they uh, have a shade, so it's dark. And there's also mosquito netting, you'll see, because there is a lot of, there are a lot of mosquitoes in this area, especially at night, so no one wants to get bitten up. But this is your average room in an average building in an average college. So, so much for that. You're good. Look what I fra uh, found in Frank's apartment, Songzi. Uh, this is what I said is eaten over Dragon Boat Festival. The school gives us a couple each just to com commemorate the festival. And it's a 
piece of weed wrapped up, uh, some meat wrapped up in some weed, and some paste, bean paste, and other stuff they put in. And it's really delicious. But after a day or two, you get rid of it. And um, Frank's lemon, you got. Ooh, yeah, lemon okay. I got. Here we go. Here we go. One more thing I wanted to show you in an apartment, and all the Ooh, students, good. is that you there is no toilet paper when you go to the bathroom. It's not like a regular college where you go and you use toilet paper. You have to bring your own toilet paper because people just steal the toilet paper and the school doesn't provide it. So you have to buy your own toilet paper, which is very strange. Okay, we're going outside. We'll see you soon. Cool. Here we go. Okay? Yeah. So Frank, you're going to dinner with your friends? Yeah, she's my colleague in New Oriental. In New Oriental? Yeah. So, where are you meeting? Where are other places, big places to eat around here? Because we're going to the uh, cafeteria, school cafeteria. Where are you going? Uh, in a uh, normal university. Okay. Yeah, that is a long street with a lot of small uh, stores. Okay. So a lot of different places to eat. Yeah, yeah. How far is it from here? Mm, it, not close. I can ride my e-bike there. Ah, nice, nice. And uh, you come back later. Yeah. All right. Cool. Have a good dinner. Yeah. Maybe we'll see you later. And you, how long are you off from work for? Because uh, I know you work many days a week. Oh yes, I uh, work five days a week and I already have to do something uh, in the weekend. He says he works five days a week, but it's really seven. <laughs> <laughs> All right, have a great dinner, Frank. We'll talk yeah. to you later. Yeah. All right, good seeing you. Yeah. All right, talk to you later. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye.